What is good, Mama Squad? And welcome back to our channel. It's looking a little gloomy today. Yeah, we got some rain coming in, but that's not gonna stop us mm -hmm. from trying, okay, to eat the healthiest options at, at fast, fast food, food restaurants. restaurants, okay? Starbucks and is fast food? It definitely is because you go through the, I feel like anywhere that has a drive-thru is fast food. Okay. Because they have to be fast. So, and they make food. First stop, we of course have to do Starbucks. <laughs> I'm gonna look up online right now. What is the healthiest? <clears throat> From Starbucks. My guess it's gonna be one of them protein boxes. What is the healthiest meal? Avocado toast, maybe. Or those protein boxes at the end. We went to Starbucks this morning. We always go to Starbucks. It says, oh. What? Classic whole grain oatmeal. Ooh, okay. Spinach and feta white wrap, which we had. We had last. this morning, yeah. Egg white and the avocado the spread. Egg white but that's, is that breakfast? Healthy breakfast food? Or is that just the healthiest food in general? Well, Starbucks is breakfast. What do you think about it? Yeah, they have some lunch options. Kind of, but more so Starbucks is like morning fast food, I feel like. I say we get the oatmeal. The oatmeal. We it's try on the that top out. of the list. That's the top of the top. That's why I love Starbucks. They have a little bit of everything, you yeah. know? Yeah. They actually, wow. We're eating good, I guess. <laughs> we eating good. <laughs> so I also looked up um, the healthiest drink from Starbucks, and we're gonna get the iced skinny latte, which is only 70 calories. I mean, technically the healthiest drink would be water, yeah, but true. for an actual drink, we're gonna try this skinny thing and see if it's I don't good. I don't even know what, it, what that is. You're gonna means. have to re-say it to me, because I, don't, I already forgot what the name. It's iced skinny latte. And what are we getting, the oatmeal? The classic oatmeal. Okay. Yes. Hi, welcome to Starbucks. What can I get started for you today? Can I get a classic oatmeal? Classic oatmeal. And then can I get a uh, grande. grande iced skinny latte? Grande iced skinny latte as well. And that'll be oh. it. All right, you're all set. Thank you. Ooh, I'm Let's excited. Get it. So this is the skinny iced skinny latte. latte. I think I think that's what it's Guys, called. We're gonna give it a little taste test right me, now. I get this a lot. Oh, they didn't get brown sugar, but I guess that's a good thing because then the brown sugar. The brown sugar is bad. what makes it worse. So but we gotta eat just the whole. I'm gonna try this grain. It Smells like an iced caramel macchiato. Oh, this is like straight coffee. Like if you're a coffee lover, it says this, 70 calories. I don't know how true that is. This is definitely your go-to if you're a coffee lover, but you're not gonna like this. Not. Try a sip. It's like dark coffee. I can't eat this without. Yeah. Do you know why? Because you don't eat oatmeal without brown you got, sugar. You need brown. You need flavor. That's normal whole grain oatmeal. Mmm. Oatmeal. Mmm. It's decent. It's coffee. It's not coffee. Not my favorite cup of tea, you know what I mean? Well, it's not a cup of tea, it's a cup of coffee. But it's crazy that this is 70 calories. I know, right? Actually, that makes sense. You wanna know why that makes sense? Because get the coffee- Get that finger out of my face. No, because the coffee that we get from the store, you remember how the calories aren't even that high? And we make oh, them the Starbucks yeah. drink? Oh, yeah. So You're that right. makes sense. I bet you that's what they use. Yeah, yep. See? We figure out our own stuff every day. Go off day. Starbucks. Because Bill will have a, a coffee sometimes, and it'll be from like, when you go to like Target or you know any place, you can get like the Starbucks um coffee. What? They only have what? It's like 15, it's like 30 calories for the whole thing. Yeah, and you it's only have so, it's like zero nothing. carbs, right? Zero, zero carbs, sugar. zero sugar, and it tastes like- It tastes so good. So good, it's like vanilla bean yeah. or whatever. So, hey. Starbucks, you passed the health test. You did, because we come <laughs> here every day, so this makes me feel a lot better. I know, we're doing something right. <laughs> All right, you guys, next up on the agenda is McDonald's. McDonald's. So, I'm a little confused about McDonald's' menu a little bit. You would think a salad would be healthy. You would think that some sort of like, you know, well, I greens. I think it was on there, I think it was. But, but it wasn't the top. You no, know, I don't know though, but it said the top healthiest was their breakfast wrap burrito. But it is currently 3.41 in the so afternoon. So can't get breakfast. Breakfast is so over. So they said a McChicken. And or then, chicken nuggets. Yeah, and then chicken nuggets. So we're gonna get both because they're the healthiest. So I'm confused how that's healthiest, but. Because that's just how it is. People say the salads are actually the worst. Yeah, they are. You see that lightning? Oh. Oh, it's gonna rain. I hope you guys heard that. Those girls better get home. So we're gonna take order. Um, can I get a four-piece chicken nugget and then a McChicken with extra mayo? With extra mayo. That'll be it. Thank you. Gotta love McDonald's. We got the food. We secured the bag. Yes. Oh. Here's your McChicken, extra mayo. We got the four-piece nugget right here. Boom. So these are the two healthiest things they say besides the breakfast wrap, which is kind of crazy. I'm surprised a little bit. But mm. I mean, McDonald's is not healthy in general, but. Mm. Well, I mean, any fast food is not really gonna be the best for you. Mm -mm. If they can make the food in under five minutes, it's really not gonna be the best for you. Yeah. 
let's just face it, but we're trying to find the best. Like we're trying to help help you out a little bit. And you know what's funny? Mmm. McChickens are literally my favorite food from McDonald's. Wow, she really forgot my ranch though. They always do that. Whatever. But McChickens, I you know every time I go to McDonald's, my favorite thing to eat from there is McChicken. With extra mayo. Because they don't add enough mayo with one. It's like half of the chicken has mayo on it. Woo! So it's hot? Mm-hmm. What do you mean? These definitely just come out the oh. other. <laughs> Alright, I get a bite. Oh my gosh. That mayo is like spewing Picking, out. right? I know mayo's probably... Well, mm. Is mayo bad for you? I don't think mayo's bad for you, is it? So good. I don't think mayo's bad. It's probably better than like ketchup or something. I'll bite. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, I'm starving. I haven't eaten all day. Mmm. Mmm. Spank, dank, and good, right? You said spank, dank, and good. Spank, spank, spank dank, and good. Dank, and good. Yeah. McDank's a spank, dank, and good. What she said. You hear that? <laughs> McDonald's a spank, dank, and good. Oh my god, it was far. <laughs> All right, so we're at the next stop, and we're actually going to Wendy's this yes. time. I looked up on Google, so the main healthiest things there is actually a junior cheeseburger. Which is crazy. And then after that, it says apple, pecan, chicken, salad. So we're going to get both of those. Mm. There are a couple more salads on the list and stuff, but for what I'm seeing, it's those two. Yummy. They sound pretty good. That sounds good to me. I could go for a junior cheeseburger yeah. or a junior burger, whatever the heck you get yeah, for that. Yeah, I, I never even heard of that. But me either. We I rarely know, I come to Wendy's. I have heard I, of a junior. I feel like every time we come to Wendy's, we get like nuggets or I something. I never eat at Wendy's, but Wendy's um, nuggets are really good. Yeah, and fries. The, yeah. Oh my God. The and they're um, the Frosties. Oh, the Wendy's Oh, that's frosties. what it is. That's banging. That's oh. probably the worst for you, but the Frosties. Oh. So oh my good. god, they're amazing. Oh. Alright, baby, what do we got going on here? We got the junior burger. Ooh, I haven't had a Wendy's burger mm. in a minute. That's a fire. It does. Or is it this? Oh, it's definitely this. Look at this thing. Oh yeah. Ooh. Pickles and fries? Wait, oh I thought there was fries in that. Can you check the pickles? Dude, out? this actually looks crazy for a junior here's burger. Here's the salad, which I know Bill loves much. Hold on, salad. I'm taking this. What do you need to take off? Pickles. I like pickles. I love pickles, but not on my burger. I don't know why. Mmm. Is it good? Here, eat this pickle. Got ketchup on my face. All right, I have everything on my face. You wouldn't think a burger would be the healthiest, but I guess there's not a lot to go off the menu because like most of the stuff there is probably unhealthy. Okay. Even though it tastes good. Ooh, this salad looks banging, but Mariah's not gonna like it already, I could tell. I don't know why. Mm. Blue cheese. Hey, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, okay. uh, let's see. Instead of food at Dunkin', why yes. don't we do drinks? Ooh, we should. Switch it up like, a little bit. I was looking at the Dunkin' menu. We're going to Dunkin' Duck, and like we're actually at Dunkin' already. And the healthiest thing on the menu, it said it was a whole wheat bagel. Which I'll eat that, but I'm not in the mood to eat right I now. I say we do healthiest drink. drink, cause there's like, Do like two drinks. The only other thing that was healthy on the menu is a um, egg McMuffin thing. Oh. So let's yeah, let's do that. But first, I gotta try this pomegranate vinaigrette on this. You're gonna this, like it. On the salad. Oh my god. Isn't gosh. it funny how Jordan on the phone was like, oh no, salads are way better. I'm telling you. Oh, salads get good reps because they're just greens but at fast food places since they load them up with so much stuff most of the time salads are actually worse for you than if you ate like a burger or something oh, i forgot there's apple in here oh yeah that's probably good mm. but i won't taste that because anything that touches blue cheese I, i'll taste it mm. it tastes like blue cheese does it yeah ah! there was one time we were at a wedding and i was eating the salad and i go this tastes funky <laughs> and then bill was like yeah that's blue cheese <laughs> at the time i thought it was fresto or what is it or is that type of cheese that's on it's top? a different type of cheese yeah and i didn't know it was blue cheese and i'm like this is horrible this salad's so good though but if you don't like blue cheese i would stick with the southwest chicken salad that wendy's has because this has a lot of blue cheese in it but it's so good can i get a small unsweetened iced tea that's the first one and then a small iced cappuccino and that'll be it all right you can put it. thank you all right so not gonna lie that was only six dollars for two what and you already know the other places it's like ten dollars for two so you're saving a little bit here dude this looks good oh my god Wait, not gonna lie, I think this is gonna be a pretty, smack. Pretty smack, yeah. Let's see. Let's see. It was only three bucks. It looks smack it. It wasn't even three dollars, like two dollars on the I'm excited for that one. I hope it's not like a bust. What? You gotta mix it, that's why. I had all the coffee. I can't wait for Mariah to try this one. I don't like sweet tea. So the only reason why I like unsweetened iced tea more than the average person is because my mom actually got me into it and uh, you're not gonna like unsweetened iced tea at all. You're not. Wait, you're not cringing out? I'm surprised, I thought you were like, gonna be. 
I feel like that's more strong tasting mm -hmm. than this. Let's this one, see. This one kind of washed down the. Ooh, this is like the Starbucks one that we just had. Yeah. This tastes exactly like that, but this one's cheaper. Pretty decent. This yeah. one's like two dollars and like eighty cents or something. You think that's got caffeine in it? This? Oh, yeah. definitely. It's like a coffee. It's not bad though, I kind of like it. For drinks at Dunkin', they're definitely cheaper than any other place we went to so far. Yeah, you're right, they really are cheap. It was five bucks for two. They said these were the healthiest. Guys, we might be totally wrong. We're just going off of Google. We're going off of whatever the first yeah. thing we see on Google. For price, good. For taste, it's an acquired taste, I feel yeah. like. Yeah, I feel like this is so fun because I kind of get to learn like a little bit about like, honestly, I, I didn't realize some of the stuff we eat isn't really all that. It's terrible because it's like got fats and stuff in it, but like. But there's some good stuff about it. Yeah. But we do have one more place to go. And we gotta end it with a bang. We gotta end it with and you a bang. I'm really excited about because we're gonna be in, in the my toilet favorite, at the end of Bangway. <laughs> my favorite thing that I get from here is top of the list. Is it actually? Mm -hmm. I feel like I know what you're talking about. All right, let's see. I. No. What? No, it's what I eat. There. I no, said that's, that's definitely that's a not piece of healthy. Food oh, that's okay. definitely not healthy. Come on. We'll what see else when do I get I there. Go? Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, I guess we could tell you what the last place is now. We are at the one, the only Taco Bell. Yeah. And I did guess wrong. I guessed it was the cinnamon swirls that were the healthiest, which obviously they wouldn't be. Oh, put the zero sugar taco bell. Bell. Okay, oh, you. that's what we could do. Um, hi, can I get a taco supreme? Soft. Uh, soft. And okay. then a uh, burrito supreme. And then can I get a large, um, the zero sugar Baja Blast? Okay, I'm just gonna do a number three for you. Okay, yeah, that'll work. Thank you. Can I get anything else for you? That'll be it. Guys, I totally forgot. Taco Bell has zero sugar Baja, Baja Blast. Blast. Like, like what? What? No, we were eating online the other day and we're like zero sugar and it tastes the same. Zero calorie, zero carb, Baja Blast. Like, no, I don't have zero calories, is it? I'm pretty sure it is. Correct me if I'm wrong. She said zero Baja Blast. So I'm zero pretty sugar. sure that means zero. usually the zero sugars have zero calories, but mm. I don't know. All right, so we gotta try the Baja Blast first. Ready? Yeah, I can't try that though. Oh my god. Yeah. Why does it taste like Sprite to them? Really? Yeah. Mm. Is that how it tastes? It's more like Sprite, right? A little bit. Hey, it's still good. It's still deep. It's still Not gonna lie. Fire. It's still busting. Here is your taco. Mm. Or is this it? Oh no, this is definitely a burrito. burrito you sure. think I had enough food? Mm -mm. Never, never say never. It's taco Bell. Let's try it out. So this, oh my god, Cheers. this burrito. How is this one of the healthy things? Mm. It's not. It's definitely not. Like it's just the tortilla. Good. Just the tortilla itself is probably worse than like a whole bagel. I was not saying it's healthy for you, but mm. it's the healthiest. Mm. Oh yeah. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah. Mm -mm. Oh my god! Can't wait to be blown up the toilet later. I know, we, with all this fast food. Uh, I hope we don't get food poisoning. We'll be good. We'll be good. We but yeah, all this, tomorrow. all this fast food. Oh my gosh! I think I'm maxed out right now. Um, I'm not trying to eat anything else tonight. I'm not Maybe either. a snack. I'm, I'm not even gonna eat dinner. This is our dinner. I agree. I think I'm actually good with fast food for like a week. I don't want to eat ever again. Barber Squad, I hope you enjoyed this video. These were the top healthiest things that we found at these fast food places. Now, could be totally wrong. There could be better things there, but this is just what we looked up and what we found. I hope this helps you out a little bit if you're trying to eat a little better. But if you are honestly trying to eat better, like I wouldn't go to fast food places. Yeah. Like honestly, it'd just be cheaper just to go to like a store yeah, and go make your own taco. buy a salad or something. A little carb taco. Yeah, eat it without a tortilla. Yeah. Like if you ate this all without the tortilla be good. it'd be 10 times better oh, yeah. but you guys we have been enjoying our challenges so if there's any other challenges you guys want us to do on our channel please comment them down below we are up for all the ideas i honestly i really enjoy doing them they're really yeah. fun and we've been trying a lot of different stuff and new yeah. things so it kind of gives us a little insight on stuff that we wouldn't normally try or do yep but you guys Ooh. i hope you enjoyed today's video and, and we will we'll see you in the, the next one, one. but until, until then, then peace love, love you guys, guys.